Hello there and welcome back to Let's Play Risen. I am the RN Genius, but you may, you may call me Eric. And in the last episode, we left off in Harbor Town. We talked to everybody in the brothel. We um, got to know the lighthouse keeper and we got to know this fine gentleman right here who is acquainted with Eric, the master, the former master of arms in the monastery. Oh well, we're going to continue talking to people around this, sea, uh, this region. No. I'm not giving you anything. Do I look like I want something? Not collecting for the farmers, then? You're one of the Don's men. Nothing gets past you, does it? So, what's going on here? Not much. Can't do anything while those scum-sucking white-robed bastards won't let me out of their sight. Why are the white robes watching you? Well, because they know I hate them. And they think I'm a thief. And are you? Hmm. Of course not. I even used to offer protection to the merchants. And get paid for it. That's how business works. And now, now, Carlos is just waiting for me to give him a reason to banish me from the town. But I won't give him the chance. What do you know about Commandant Carlos? Warrior of the Inquisition. A slimy, filthy bog slug who happens to be the new lord of the town. He and his guards represent the law. They behave like there are no laws at all. May they drown in the fifth hell. I could help you. How? Let me join you. I'll work for you. Why? Why should I even trust you? This town's full of spies and collaborators. Because you'll find and duck me if I fail. You know what you'd be getting into. Don Esteban hates people who try to cheat him. And so do I. I could work for you. You want a chance? I might need you. So, you have your chance. What is it you want me to do? Don Esteban controls most of the Bruegel on the island. Leonardo, the alchemist, he processes the harvest. Then Garth, the alchemist's assistant, brings it to us. But recently, some of the goods have gone missing. So, somebody's taking it. Do you suspect anyone? Garth. I think Garth's behind it. Why don't you punish him? I can't risk those infernal white robes finding out. And even though Garth is a coward, I don't know if a beating will make him talk. How does the Bruegelweed get into the town? You don't need to know that. What if the goods are disappearing on their way in? No. When Leonardo gets the goods, they're complete. What do you want me to investigate? Garth is too stupid to do this on his own. Somebody's paying him. You follow Garth when he delivers the weed packages. And when he meets his partner, you grab both of them. You want me to do that alone? I'd gladly break their ratty bones with you, but the white robe pigs won't let me out of their sight. What's in it for me? Let's be clear. You belong to the monastery. I'm the Don's man. Yet you want to help me. We well, must have your reasons. But we won't work together again after this business. The Don wouldn't like that. I'll pay you decently, and even toss in a couple of mana potions. I can't do more than that for you. So think about it. I'll follow Garth. Good. Garth works across from here in the Alchemist's house. Stand next to me, or behind me, so he doesn't notice you right away. He's a nervous sort. Hmm. Uh. I'm ready to follow Garth. Garth's leaving. Give him a bit of a head start, then follow him. Keep your distance, but don't let him out of your sight. If anything goes wrong, come back. Got it? Is that Garth? That's Garth. That's probably not the best idea. But at least Garth won't notice me like that. I can just do it like this. That's better than I don't have to run a meter and then stop and run a meter and then stop. 
just walk like a completely normal person. He wouldn't notice me like this, would he? He's gotten quite far away. What's she doing there? Hey, sweetheart. How about I make a real man of you? Once you get some lily loving, you'll never look back. Sorry, I'm not interested. Come on, love. How long has it been since you had a warm body beside you? What part of I'm not interested did you not understand? All right. All wow. Right. So Can't Garth. Blame a girl for trying. He just disappeared now, didn't he? Sid? That Garth. Could be. Could be. Oh, sorry. What I wanted to walk. I assume for? that that right there is Garth. I, I point with my stick, by the way. I'm not entirely sure, though. Because I can't see his name like this, and I, I don't know a button to show me the interface. So, quick save, walk in on them. Oh crap, what do you want? Did, did you follow me? It really wasn't hard. Hey you, yeah, you, yeah. I've seen you about, nosing in everyone's business. People don't like people's noses being stuck into other people's business. People like that get hit by people. Hand over the packages you took. Sure you want to do this? Absolutely. Then you leave me no choice. Garth, get him! Shut his flapping... Uh, two on Time one, really? Lesson. Oh, God. Of course, both of them block that. Oh, Garth is really weak, though. So I just have to strafe around them for a bit. Come on. I have to hit Garth one more time, and after that I can take care of the other one. I, I blocked! How can you hit me through my block? Oh god. This guy's a man. Ah. Don't walk. I want his stuff. I'm sorry. I think I want his stuff. Okay, now drink a potion while running. Oh, you jerk! Ah, there was a set of stairs I could have run up. Didn't know about that. No, Cutter's a little stronger. Mm. Really, drink another potion here. I don't think I'll even keep this save. I don't I don't I don't think killing Garth is a good idea. How can this guy be so strong? Is it just that spears suck? Because they are so slow? Maybe it would be a better idea for me to... Of course you loot me. And a what few now? Coins for me. What does Garth have? Minor stuff. 
Now, would you rather walk away or crawl? Hang around here and All right, I'll qu I'll yours. load my quick save then. Hung. Fight both of them at the same time. That other that this douche is a. He's actually strong. Hmm. I bleed so many potions doing this. I wish I could use magic, but I can't yet. Yet. Ah, oh, crap. What do you want? Did, did you follow me? It really wasn't hard. Hey, you. Yeah, you. Yeah. People don't like people's noses being stuck into other people's business. People like that gets hit. Hand over the pack. Short. Absent. Then you leave. Garth. Get him! Shut his flapping mouth. Time for a little lesson. Okay, this is gonna be rough. Of course we want to take out Garth first. Always take out the weaker enemy. No, I can't see... Oh, fun. Don't want to get hit 10,000 times here, jerk. I wish someone would interfere with them and even attack them as well. Why can you hit from the back row there? You, sh you slice up guards good. Slice them up good. Oh, I blocked that. Can't believe it. Is it really just about Garth? Let's see, if I wait around here for a bit, what happens? Maybe he's just gonna pick up his sword again. Ha! Someone should stop this. There'll be trouble, mark my words. Stop. Just stop. Coward. I wish, man. Cease this. Oh. What a fight. What a fight. I never forget a face. Cut her. I never forget a face. This is not necessary. You're right about that. He's too close. This shouldn't be happening. What? Oh. I never forget a face. Cease this. Too close. Stop. Just stop. Coward. Stop calling me a coward. I know I'm shooting you with arrows, just because I cannot take you on with a stick. Now I'll we've assembled a face. crowd. You're just gonna keep standing there. I, I, I like that. Look at all these arrows stuck in his body, and this guy keeps going and going and going. There'll be trouble. Mark my words. <laughs> Oh. Ah, he got out of his. There's a dude in there. Uh oh. It won't do any good. Oh man, can you please stop walking behind me? The crowd is not a good thing in this game. I don't want to attack you people. Come on. That's it. Again. Oh, what? Good hit. 
Ooh. That was one hell of a parry. Beautiful. Get his stuff, all of it. Take your rusty sword and your war shield. <sighs> Save that. What do you say about that? I want to improve my fighting skills. What can you teach me about combat? Has your brain fallen out? After the crap you put me through, forget it. Now start talking. Look, I didn't mean to step on the Don's toes. You stole his weed. That's pretty much stomping on them. I... I wasn't going to sell it in Harbour Town. Then where? Just, uh, just in the monastery. They all love a bit of Bruegel up there. You should remember it's the Don's Bruegel. They're rich up there. Loads of gold. It's all that poking around in the ruins. Who else is involved in this Bruegel smuggling? Just me. And Eric, right? You know about him. I know a lot of things. It was his idea. Kept talking about getting what he was owed from Hemlar, one way or another. He wanted to sell the Bruegel himself. Yeah, yeah, of course. It's always the other guy. Yeah, I do. I really I mean, do. You got nothing better to do. Oh, man, this area was rough. Of course, now where did, um, where did the other one, ah, that's Belshur, Druid's Hemlock, I'll take that with me as well. That seems to be a mushroom, I think Druid's Hemlock is a mushroom. May the holy flame light your way, stranger. Are you looking for a spot of warm fire, or some stew to salve your hunger? I come from the monastery. I was asked to seek you. Finally, my brethren send help. I'm sure I'll find a job for you. I was sent to see what the Don's men, the outlaws, were doing here. Well, if that is your task, you should talk to the warriors of the Order. Rodriguez, Marcelo, Carrasco, and the others will tell you what is to be done. I could use some stew. Here, may it grant you strength. Thank you. What can I do for you? Help me to care for the people. There are those who are sick and injured. They are in need of healing potions. I can distribute those healing potions for you. Good, good. Thank you. I have seven potions prepared. I will give you a list with the names of the needy here in the gutters. Consider the remaining potions payment for your work. New quest, medicine for everyone. But before that, I want to talk to Garth, and then I want to... Hey, wait a minute! Don't walk by, try the best fish in town! This is your lucky day, because I have one perfect Piscine offer for you. You do. Buy one fish, and get a second fish completely free. Two fish for the price of one! Sounds like a good deal. Too risky. Hmm. I don't want to talk to this guy right now. I want to see Garth. See what he has to say for himself. Also, I got that war shield. Is that any good? Hey. War shield. Shield for the town guard. That's not half bad. Blunt weapon damage three. But still before that I should... I, I wish I knew where a water barrel was in this town, but I don't. But I don't. But I know what's up with the packages. So weasel. Garth's working with Cutter. Cutter? He lets us pay him so we can work in peace, and then he steals from us. That bastard had sucked bog bodies if he thought there was money in it. What about the packages? Did he have them on him? 
We need those packages. Here are the packages you wanted. Here are the packages you wanted. Good work. A lot of gold is coming your way. And here are your mana potions. That was a good deal. Pity you didn't join us. Just think of the profit we could have made. Well, you can't have everything. Now be careful. Those bloody white robes are still everywhere. Hmm. Right. Now let's hear the truth. It's Cutter's fault. He made me do it. He did, he did. He wanted me to set aside some weed for him. Just a bit. What did he give you for it? Me. And some gold. But it wasn't much. And I haven't any left. Please don't tell Carlos. I couldn't hack it in the monastery. I'm not cut out for it. I have allergies. Just get out of here. Thanks. Haven't I seen you hanging around the brothel? <laughs> what? What, me? No, no, not me. You wouldn't catch me there. I mean, real men don't pay for it, do they? They, well, you know, um, it, it wasn't me, you saw. Yeah, you're right. And you are a real man. <laughs> how about, how about not right now? Uh, maybe I save before. If I can. Gotta start again. That was my last lockpick. What? Oh. I'm gonna. Oh! I'll buy some lockpicks then. I didn't need. I, I didn't think I was gonna burn through them like this. Stop making weird noises. Uh, I'm going to eat a little bit of... You got stew there. I need a little bit of stew. A little bit of meat. To get back up. I think in the tavern she had log pigs for sale. I think. I'm not entirely sure. I'd return to the main road. Patty. Do you have anything to trade? There's lockpicks. I'll take a uh, ten. For one hundred. Ah, uh, I might as well take all of them. It's not like I don't have a use for them. Anything else worth worth selling? Not right now. Alrighty, let's run back and start continue where we left off. That's Rodriguez. Why would you keep me from running after Garth? There's plenty of others with gossip. Try them. Okay, quick save. Nobody's looking except the weasel. He can handle a secret. That wasn't it. Oh. Damn. Yes. That was a rather difficult lock, actually. I wish you could co close doors behind you, but you really can't. Better start again. Job well done. Bolts take all. There's another chest back here, and that could be that didn't do it. what I was looking for. Job well done. Recipe for a small healing potion. I already know this. Still decent enough. Apart from that, they could have watched me from there. You could have seen me. Is this the shack? Yes. Nope. That didn't do it. 
Yes. Why is there a switch? That just opened this door. And now I'm where? Bunch of stuff. I'll have to pick this. I'll have to pick this. Or find the key. I think I already have the key. I'll have to pick this. Or find the key. Hmm. Not good enough at picking that lock, am I? So before we go in here, I hope you enjoyed this episode. And I hope I will see you in the next episode as well. Until next time, bye-bye.